Hey Bye Bakers, it's Lila with LB Novelties and today I'm filming a quick review of this awesome stackable storage piece that lots of style shops sent to me. It is a stackable jewelry charm craft tray organizer storage display with clear lid for drawer craft vanity and it comes in white. I know it's a long title but that's just how it's listed. Um, and I just don't have the lid on it because of the glare from the ring light, but it comes with this really beautiful um, clear acrylic piece that sits right on top and pardon the glare guys. Let me do this. This will be easier. Um, so it sits right on top. So it's nice and flat. What I love about this is you can, you know, put items right on top. Like if you want to stack your perfume or something, which I'm going to be doing, I'm really excited to do that. And it comes with all these compartments here. So you get eight of these size pieces. So like this will be your medium, a large box, two rectangles, and then two more smaller pieces similar to this size. And then this is um, one large piece with six little slots for you to store um, jewelry and stuff. But I'm really happy that they sent this out to me because um, during fall, I love to wear like gold jewelry, warm tone jewelry. And I was thinking this will be a really great way to display jewelry that I wanna make sure I put on. Um, Cause sometimes I'm just very like, I'll just put some earrings on or not wear jewelry at all. So I feel like this is gonna really make me want to accessorize uh, my outfits and have it really nicely organized so it comes with again this piece right here and it has this little hole right in the middle so you can just lift it up easily but it like lays super flat so let me bring that up that's how it lays and i love that that it's flat and then it has this groove right here so if you have their um drawer piece um you can stack that right on top of it but i'm just gonna have this sitting on my dresser by my my vanity area but I wanted to show you a couple of ways you can use this in a, a you know if all about organization you guys know how much I love organization so I'm going to show you just a couple of ways you can organize with this not just for for jewelry and this retails for $15.99 on Amazon but they actually gave me a discount code for my vibe makers which is 30 novel tees so i'll put it right here 30 novel tees you use that on the amazon link below that i um that they sent me and they will give you 30 percent off promo code um and uh so just make sure you use that link below the amazon link for um lots of style not my storefront but the one for lots of style because i'll have two different amazon links right below in my description box so i'll make sure to put it in bold lots of styles um link so you guys can get one of these if this is something you're interested in and one more thing, y'all, how freaking cute is this? When I got this, it came with stickers. Y'all know we love stickers. So I think this is really cool because when I've gotten other items from them in the past, um, I hadn't gotten stickers, but these are so cute. And it says uh, lots of style. So I think they know that uh, a good majority of their customers are crafters like us and planners and love our stickers. So that's really cool. Cause I do use, um, this is something they sent out to me a while back, like last year when I was in squad and this is a trash bin and, and if you can tell I'm using it, <laughs> but I love their products and their material and, and it's really well built. Cause I've had this over a year. Cause I'm telling you, I've got this when I was on squad and it's still kicking and I haven't even gone through all those rolls of paper, uh, trash bins that, um, it came with trash bags, excuse me. So yeah, I love that. And if you want to share yourself using this, um, make sure you use hashtag lots of style on Instagram and they might feature you. So that is main information about this. Um, is there anything else I'm missing before we get into, you know, organizing in here? I think that's pretty much all. So I'm going to show you a few ways of how you can use it. And then the last um, part, it will be how I'm how myself I'm going to be using this to organize, you know, jewelry at home. Okay. So the first way I'm going to show you how you can use to organize this is for those of you like me who love press on nails. Um, right now I'm currently using my dashing diva nails. Um, I love dashing diva nails. They're easy to put on. They're like little, um, sheets of like stick, kind of like a sticker you put on your nail and it's, it's, it lasts. I've had this over a week now, about close to a week and a half and I'm just rocking them out and they haven't chipped or anything. So, um, I love press on nails as well from Impress. And um, you guys know I love Impress nails too. But um, I was thinking a really fun way to use this for those of you that use press on nails, you know sometimes um, the nails come with 30 and you only have 10 fingers. So you'll have extras. And what I do is I have them in this bin, all my extra press-ons. So I was thinking this would be a really great way to organize for those of you that want to um, 
organize your press-ons. So maybe in the future, I might buy an extra one of these just to organize my press-ons, but I'm gonna show you how I would do it just because I like to give you guys ideas of how you can organize this to have kind of like your little manicure. And maybe you can have this sit on top and you can have your, your nail polish sitting on top of this, like some pretty nail polishes right above if you wanted to. But um, I wanna show you real quick how easy it is to use this to organize. And I'm a big fan of organizing like having organizational pieces, using boxes, whatever to organize. So these are just some nail files that I have for my Dashing Divas. I would put these little wood picks in here as well. Um, and then how I would do this is these are just lots of nails that are extras um, that I don't use because some of them might not, they might, when I get my impress, like, you know, they have to fit a certain size. So whenever my best friend or my cousin come over, they have to dig through <laughs> this big bag of like extra. So that's something like I would recommend is like if you do have these, I would separate them. I mean, it'll just take a little bit, but I'm gonna give you a little example. So I'm gonna separate them by color. And I'm gonna show you another tip in a, in a bit of how you can actually organize this as well. Cause y'all know I love organization and it's one of my biggest, you know, excitements is when I see a good organizational piece and I'm just like, wow, that's awesome. I love it. Um, and I'm actually watching uh, the home edit on Netflix and um, it is such a cool show, like all about organizational items and how to organize closets and pantries and et cetera. So it's really cool. So I'm just showing you quickly what I would do. And I'm not gonna sit here and go through all of these nails because then we'd be in a long, long how video. I would organize this, right? So then you would put your lid and I'm gonna have to figure out how to do this so you don't get blinded by the lid. So let me just close this and put this to the side so we can have space. What I would do for those of you that want to use this as a nail organizer for your press-ons, once you spend the time, put some music on to relax and separate all your nails, um, I would get a um, label maker. And I'm gonna show you an example. So I'm gonna do French. And I have clear um, tape roll in this. So this is a Dymo Letra tag. This is, um, I believe, it's about $18 at Target. I got this last year, it's working really nicely still. And I'm just gonna change the stocks ahead it for vertical, okay? So we're gonna put uh, French. So again, it's in the clear paper, so that's why I'm going to print it. So it's printing out. I love a, la a good label maker is just amazing. So that's what it looks like, French. Now, I'm not gonna necessarily tape it down here because I don't want it to get, leave a residue, but I would, I'm just gonna show you so you can see what I'm talking about. And please excuse the ring light craziness. <laughs> I'm gonna angle this, there we go. So it says French, I would put French, I'm gonna lightly put it down. So I can still peel it off. I would put French like that. And then that way you know this is your French section, French manicure. I would put down like nude, red, glitters, or you could probably put these two nudes together. This is more like a mauve. Um, and so I would do it like that. And that way you know what is each um, color. I mean, you can see it, but if you really wanna get like real deal organizational uh, skills in here, I will label it. I just love when stuff is labeled. So that I, I honestly think my, I might buy one more of these just uh, down the road so I can label all my impress. So when my friends come over and be like, you wanna do your, you know, you wanna make yourself a manicure, go ahead. And then they know, okay, I, I wanna do this and that, you know, mix it in. So that's one option of how to use this. So you, it's really easy to get creative with these storage pieces. I love how it, you know it's organized and laid out and you can add even like alcohol pads, um, you know, those like pre-packaged alcohol, uh, excuse me, alcohol pads. I would put some of those here. I don't have some on hand because if not, I would show you. But um, the impressed nails come with them, but you, they only send you one because it's just for one manicure. So you can buy those at your local, um, grocery store I've seen them like in the first aid section um, the little alcohol pads I would put some of those because it's always good to clean out your nails before you lay out any press so there's no residue of like lotion or anything that you might have on there so label maker is amazing um, and so that's how I would do it with the nails and now I'm going to show you another way to organize it for something in regards to crafts and your workspace all right, so now we have this to use for crafting your workspace, your desk drawer, whatever it is that you wanna kind of organize. I love that it's really thin, like I said, so it's not gonna take up that much space on your desktop. 
But um, what you can actually use this for is storing washi tape, um, your happy planner disc, sticky notes, and tweezers. And I'll just show you how I would organize it. Um, I would like to have this like inside my desk drawer. I have a desk drawer right over here. This is my desktop. So you can have everything organized. But um, what I love is like if you have like the mini planner disc, you can store it like this. Super cute. And then your washi you can store like this. It'll be kind of hard to see what it is, but if you organize it by um, color, so this one's a little bit larger. Um, if you organize it by color, because if you stack it like this, it's not gonna sit flat. Unless you don't wanna use this, then this would be really great if you wanted to you know, store washi standing up, which, oh my gosh, that is kind of a nice view. Like, And then also you can organize it by color but you won't be able to cover it. So that's something like if you just wanted to have this on your desktop, everything's super organized. This would be really nice for those of you that use washi a lot, but I'm showing you how you can use it with the box close, or excuse me, the lid on it. So I'm gonna finish, you know, just adding a couple more washies. Um, this one's a little bit larger, so I can probably fit it over here. Actually, I'll just put that to the side. So we'll just put some more of the regular happy planner because that one, it was a washi from Damask Love. Okay, and then you have, you know, your regular classic size planner disc. So those could fit right there. I have my jar. Oh, I forgot I have my little sticky notes. So I can add sticky notes to this. I have my tweezers. Maybe I'll put this sticky note by itself. Um, you have some of the bigger size ones. You can lay on like that. Let's add some more of these actually on this side. So that's how you can organize it if you wanted to have like your washi tape. That looks really pretty on the viewfinder. I was concentrating on filling this in. <laughs> but see, everything's super organized. If you're someone that doesn't like a lot of planner supplies, like you like just need your basics, this is something really great to organize it in where you don't feel overwhelmed, like everything has its place and you can get to whatever it is that you need and um, plan. So again, it's a really fun way to kind of put everything into compartments, then you cover it up and everything fits even with that blue runner tape. This one is from AdTech. So in case you were wondering what size, that's how it fits. Super nice. I love that. Really cool. So again, you can use it with the lid closed for crafting or if you're someone that collects a lot of washi, which nothing wrong with that because I love washi. I still have a full three door container with washi, but if I were to happen to kind of get back into washi again where I'm needing more, um, that's a really great way to kind of store them, but you wouldn't be able to put the lid. But it like could organize it really nicely for those of you that collect washi a lot. And you could just have this sitting on top of um, like a drawer, a drawer piece. So again, I love this stackable tray. Like it's really awesome. So I'm assuming that when it says stackable, you can get another one of these and stack right above it. And then you can also, if you do that, label this right here and say washi. Then the next one that you purchase would be um, happy planner disc. And then the next one could be planner supplies tool. And then you can have three of them stacked up together. Another way you can do it as well is like if you wanted to know if you're doing the washing, you're like, I don't know which washi is there. Bring out the label maker. I would label right in here, right in this area. I would label purple, red. So when you look in here, you can see, oh, okay, this is my red section. That's one way I would do it. Or like I said, you can always label right above this um, using clear paper. And then you can label this red, purple, and then you would know um, what what is each container holding. So it's all about just getting creative with what you have, using label makers. Um, you don't even need a label maker if you don't have one. Bring out your colorful boxes. They have these boxes right here. It won't be clear, but at least you know you can label stuff. So that's how I would do it. And now I'm gonna show you how I'm going to use it, which I'm really excited about. Okay, so now the last way I would use this, and of course this is my favorite one, because I love how it looks in here. Wait till you see how beautiful it looks displayed in this piece. So I have all my gold jewelry that are some of my favorite pieces, and some that are new that I haven't even used because like it was stored in my drawer. I have a jewelry drawer. So that's why I like having this. And I love that it has this clear acrylic top piece so it's nice and clean. I love a nice clean piece of like storage item or organization. So we're gonna start placing everything in. So I have this really pretty bangle. This is something my son gave me for Mother's Day one year. It's really pretty. 
And then um, I have these ones. And a lot of these are just gifted from my parents gave it to me or Chance gave it to me. So these ones are H&M. I love H&M for earrings. And then my bestie gave me this. It's a peace sign necklace. And then I'm going to use these boxes to store all my necklaces because I love wearing like really dainty necklaces. Danielle gave me this. Um, it says shine because she's sparkle and I'm shine. So that was my birthday gift from her. Super cute. You can place, ear, uh, excuse me, rings on here. So I'm going to put rings on this one. And then I'm going to place these hoops. These are some of my favorites, also from H&M. And actually, I think I'm going to put this one over here and place that one there. Because this one's just one I made with the uh, Happy Planner disc um, that came in the bracelets from their Planner Companions. I just placed it on one of these bracelets. And then I'm going to put that like that. And another necklace here. And that one just has the letter C, C for Chance, which is my son's name. I'm gonna put some earrings right over there. And then these ones, actually these I think I'm gonna display like that. And I'll keep these ones over here. And that is how I organize everything. And if I wanted to, I can put these here. And, um, but I kinda like them over here. So look how easy that was to organize that. So easy, and now I can like see everything clearly, which I love that it has this top so, you know, your um, jewelry won't get any dust on it. It'll stay clean, and it has this top on it. But see how organized it is? Nothing like organization where you're just like, yes. And then I love that I can display my perfume. So I'm just gonna sit my perfume up here and put it over there by my vanity. And I, whenever I wanna wear jewelry, I just pick this up and be like, okay, I wanna wear this and then um, be done. So I'm really happy with how this looks. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video seeing how you can use this really fun piece from Lots of Style in three different ways in three different formats. You can use it for beauty with nails. Um, you can use it also maybe to store your lipsticks. They probably might fit in here. You can use it for crafting and planner spaces um, with like all your little um, happy planner discs and planner supplies and washi tape. And finally, you can use it for jewelry um, to display it in a really beautiful and elegant way, which I love this. I'm telling you, this is just, it looks so clean and pretty. I love acrylic. <laughs> um, and I just feel like it, it really allows whatever is the uh, beautiful piece to, to be displayed. I love, that's how I have my room set up. White furniture to allow everything else to just be the main focal point. So that is really cool. Again, if you are interested in this, I'll put the code right here, 30 novelties. Um, and you can just purchase this straight from Amazon um, and get 30% off of it. And if you have Prime, it's free shipping, so that's awesome. But um, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you to Lots of Style Shop for letting me review this product. I am in love with it and I can't wait to like, you know, get fall outfits together and use my gold jewelry because I'm really excited. And this isn't real gold, I just say gold because it's the color of it, but <laughs> I'm really happy with how this turned out. If you guys like review videos, make sure to hit the like button down below. And if you are planning on purchasing this, let me know that in the comment section below which style you'll be using it. If it's gonna be for beauty, crafting, or jewelry storage. Um, if you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe to my channel. I'm always posting new fun videos in regards to planning, um, party planning, seasonal planning, planning, also how to's and reviews. So I'm always having fun over here on my channel. And as always guys, peace and love.